Hello guys, in this video we'll tell you how to fix the action center popping up in Windows 10 or 11. Before we start the video guys, if you have any computer or software related problems, please feel free to contact us by visiting our website and using the submit a problem button from there. And comment down below on our videos about a problem and don't worry, we'll make a video for you to resolve it. Number 1. Restart your computer. For this, save your any ongoing work, click on the start button and from there select the power icon and just simply choose the restart option. Number 2. Disable the four finger tapping. For this, access settings by pressing the window plus i key together and from there click on settings and devices and click on mouse and touchpad settings. In this case, choose nothing other than swipes from the drop down selection. Similarly, make sure to uncheck the box next to the four finger tapping option. This should stop the action center from whenever you touch the touchpad. Number 3. Run hardware and sound troubleshooter. For this, display the run dialog box by pressing the window plus R key together and in the run box, type msdt.exe slash id device diagnostics and press enter and just simply click on next to run the troubleshooter. Number 4. Disable the notification. For this, go to settings by pressing the window plus i key together and from there, navigate to system and click on notification and action. Then, scroll down to get notifications from the send us option. And from there, disable notifications for the problematic application. Number 5. Disable action center. For this, again go to settings by pressing the window plus i key together and from there, navigate to system and click on notifications and actions. Then just simply click on do not disturb option. Number 6. Check action center settings. For this, again go to settings and click on accessibility and choose visual effects option. Here you may choose how long the notice will be active before being discarded. Note, the quickest is 5 seconds. Number 7. Clean boot. For this, press the window plus R key together to open the run dialog box and in the run dialog box, type msc onfig and press enter to open the system configuration. And in the system configuration window, go to the services tab. Make sure to check the box that says hide all Microsoft services. Then just simply click the disable all button. After that, go to the startup tab and click on open task manager. After that, in the task manager window, disable all the startup programs by right clicking on each entry and selecting disable. Make sure to close the task manager and go back to the system configuration window and click on ok. Number 8. Run a system scan. For this, search for command prompt, right click the top result and select the run as administrator option. After that, in the command prompt, type the following command to perform a quick fix on your PC. The command is sfc slash scan now. Make sure to be patient and wait till the scanning is complete. Number 9. Remove the problematic third party software. Certain third party software, especially graphic related applications, can interfere with display settings. Try disabling or uninstalling it. Number 10. Check for any malware viruses. For this, type Windows Security in the Windows search bar and select Windows Security from the results. After that, in the Windows Security window, click on Virus and Set Protection. Then, under Current Threats, click on Quick Scan to perform a basic scan. But for a more comprehensive scan, you can also choose Full Scan. After that, just simply follow the on-screen instructions to complete the scan. So this was it for the video guys. We hope this video helped you solve your problem. If it did, then make sure that you give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. And if it did not, then don't worry. Just comment down below the issue and we'll try to figure out what is wrong with your specific case. Thank you for watching.